welcome to another video today we're going to be playing mary's arcade i believe i saw it on on face face bear face face games i don't know who the heck i keep forgetting how to pronounce it and i know who it is because i watched you know i'm subscribed but i don't know why i don't remember the name but anyways uh before we get to today's video please leave a like comment and subscribe i appreciate it and remember to share this video with a youtuber don't share it because i i'm already watching i watched the videos like three times so don't share it to me um <laughs> your favorite cousin um your uncle's mom it's your grandma let's just get into the video security guard a local restaurant is looking to hire a security guard to work the night shift from 12 a.m to 6 a.m no degree or prior experience required must be reliable easy easy work email us at jobs at marysarcade.com if interested i want to be a fry cook though i think that's one of the little things Time passes slightly faster when your laptop is down. What? <gasps> no! No! You have one new method. Hi there. Um, I thought I'd call to help you get settled in on your first shift. Oh. Um, I actually started out at a Mary's too, you know. Mm -hmm. um, it was a while ago at a different building, but still, I know what it's like in there. Um, I should probably fill you in on some of the things. Oh, those are so cute! Right now. Uh, this is this not place cute. Is in the middle of I like a that though. Facelift. Wait. Um, if you think it looks outdated now, you can't do lights. You should have seen this place a few weeks ago. Um, so far, we've installed all new arcade machines, new kitty ride, a new ball pit, new toilets, everything. Um, you should be able to see some of those on the cameras. There's no, there's no uh, camera right there. We've done a small fortune on all this stuff. Um, so I'm, I'm getting ahead of myself here. Uh, let's see. Um, Welcome to Mary's Arcade, a magical place where childhood memories are made, where people of all That's ages cute. can find something to enjoy. Mary's Arcade is not responsible for any damage to property or injuries that occur on or around playtime equipment or by our animatronic mascots. Blah, 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 all of that legal stuff. Um, oh, speaking of our mascots, though, you should probably be aware that they can walk around. Yeah. I know, I know, sounds dumb, but I'm being serious. Um, they used to let them walk around all the time, but the technology just wasn't good enough back then, and there were too many complaints and lawsuits. I wonder um, why. But as part of the new modern image for the company, the owners want to let them walk around during the daytime and interact with customers again. Um, we're still in the process of doing safety tests, though, so in the meantime, they can only walk Merry around. Merry Christmas? At night. That's a good one, y'all. Um, they're set to travel in circles around the place. An out of season so holiday. So that does mean at Merry some Christmas. point they'll pass pretty close to you. Um, you should be totally safe in there. But the last guy insisted that sometimes, instead of passing by the office, they would just stand by the windows and stare at him. Now, uh, I think he was messing with us, but if he was right. telling the truth, then that could be serious. If they're back there for too long, they might bump into something important and knock out the power. Now, uh, that wouldn't be good for you or them, so if you see them standing there, you're going to have to get them out of there and back on track. Now, uh, if you look above the map on your display, you'll see two little buttons we hooked up to each room. Mm -hmm. These act as simple remote controls for the mascots, so we can take over if need be. Um, if you play the buzzer on a mascot, it'll be frozen in place until the sound stops. Uh, the PA system there is a bit more complicated. If you play it one zone in front of a mascot, it'll come to that room. Only forwards, though, not backwards. Um, so on the off chance that you do see a mascot outside the rear window, Try pulling it past the office. Um, that's not too bad, right? Um, hey, watch those recharge times carefully, though. All right? Good night. Did you guys hear that? I'm scared. Why ain't no way, boy? Bro. Me. Oh, heck no. This music. Bruh, that's it. <laughs> so how am I supposed to get her away from so I have to press a buzzer, I think it said or something? Bro, she's out there. Good evening. Oh, Ma'am! Yes! Yes, sir. Uh-uh, why are they all weird and glitchy? Okay. 
She's okay. She's okay. She's just doing her little dancey dance. It's all. <laughs> this is actually kind of scary. It's like old fashioned, so it's like freakier. Y'all still there? Okay. What? What? Who's she talking to? Oh shoot. Stop. Bruh. Because what is she talking about? Bro, six. Immediately. That's what we like to hear. The school bell ringing to go home. Why are you working here at 6 a.m.? Do they just go back home to the little area? You have one new message. What's it say? Hi again. Did you see the mascots walking around at all last night? Yes. I told you I wasn't lying. They didn't want me to tell you that yesterday. They like to scare the new guys by leaving that part out. So just be glad you got me recording these for you and oh, not that smelly stop. weirdo Mike. Last time he trained a new guy, they... You know what, never mind. Um, anyway, I forgot to tell you yesterday that there's something else you can do from that room. Bruh. Um, if you tap and hold on either of those windows, you'll actually turn on a light outside the office. Um, when the mascots are in nighttime mode, any bright light will practically blind them. Bruh. So that should slow them down substantially. Um, you can do that if the PA system is still recharging and you need to buy yourself more time. Um, that, that should work as long as the light doesn't get too dim, of course. Wow. Uh, so watch that battery. Um, also, speaking of the mascot's Dude. nighttime mode, it Dude. turns out that they might not properly recognize you as an employee in the dark. So um, they probably think you're a customer who wandered into a staff area Where's the one guy? or an intruder. Okay. Heck, they might even think you're a costumeless mascot. But if they get to you, they'll probably try to forcefully detain you to put it lightly. Um, hey, if they do get into that room, try going limp. They might not recognize you as a person at all in that case. Bruh. So then they no. might take your empty costume and try to take you apart. Uh, you, you know what? Don't do that. Just keep them out of there, all right? Be safe. Where he at? Y'all both in the kitchen. Both of y'all stay in there, actually. I can't do this. I need the PA to go because this man's about to come to my door. Yes. <gasps> Where's the one? Oh. Can I please bite a chunk out of that? Oh, no. <gasps> no. Where's the girl? Where's she at? Oh. Shh, 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 shh. Bro, that was a little scary. I like that you can buzz like. Huh? Ah. No. Bro, where's you at? Okay, cool. Stay, both of you. Because <laughs> both of you play too much. Okay, so I like that you can buzz it and they both stay in that room. And then they cross paths. The girl's gonna come this way and the guy's gonna go that way. The badger, I think. And the fox is coming my way. Excuse me, time to use the PA system, which is good. And I think you can use the PA system on both of them if they were to both be in the same room. Want to be a magic trick? You did not! She did not just do that. Bro! That's not funny! Let me. <laughs> yeah, actually, both of y'all stay right there. Because y'all play a little too much. She said, You want to keep me Uh, no, I don't actually. Thanks, though. Shut up. No. I be doing this. I just be doing this. <laughs> Third shift, midnight. Oh my gosh. I get a phone call? You have one new message. Hey, um, I have some more advice for you. Okay. It may not be a bad idea to use the buzzer all around the building instead of just right next to the office. Holding the mascots back at any point in the place gives you more time for your PA system to recharge. So don't rely too heavily on your lights. Um, anyway, we have some power flickers today. Now, we were fine, but it occurred to me that you might not know what to do in that situation. What? So, this is very important. 
If the power goes out, just hang in there. Don't try to get up and leave and try not to make a sound. The generators should kick on in a minute or so, and if they don't, the daytime crew will get there in the morning to rescue you, all right? Um, good night. Actually, I almost forgot. Have you seen anything strange in that staff room to the left of the office? Maybe I'm just going crazy, but I swear I locked that door last night. Stop. Don't tell me that. Oh, the PA system isn't working. I can't! That's eyelashes, blank stare. The PA system! Huh? Susie? Where's she at? Who's playing music? Stop. No. Shut up. Where's that dude at? He's being suspicious. I didn't hear anything this man told me to do with power outage. I don't know. Where'd that dude go? Yeah. Y'all good. Oh no, he's coming. Oh no! Hurry up, PA system! Hurry up! Where's Miss Ma'am at? Ma'am! I need that buff- I need that, that, that buzzer to work. I need the buzzer immediately. Breakfast! Why is her- Girl, Miss Ma'am! Where is she? Oh, stop! Like straight up shit. How is it down low? How are you down? What? I'm so confused. You have one new message. Hey, are you all right? No. Yesterday we found Mary powered down in the office when we got there. Yeah. We all feared the worst, but you had already left. Not that you were in any real danger, of course. Um, anyway, there's been a development here. You know Scarlet? Yeah. The last mascot on the stage, the deer with the bonnet and the hand basket? Mm -hmm. Turns out she was never fully activated, so that should be fixed now. Uh, but she acts differently than the other two. Um, she seems to be immune to both your systems. What? We're not sure why. Um, the only thing she does respond to is being stared at. Uh, all the mascots know when they're being stared at. It's how they know when to talk or to play a little song. But Scarlet just sort of reverses course. Guess she's camera shy. Um, if you see her, try staring her down in the cameras. Uh, since Mary got in yesterday, it's probably not a good idea to let Scarlet near the office either. Um, anyway, try to be extra careful tonight. There's a lot to juggle around. Bro, what? Bro, what? Scarlet, shut up. Bro, stop. Scarlet, shut up. <laughs> Why? Why do I have to do this job? This is not easy, but it's like kind of. What? I had you on the buzzer. Now I'm going to my dear friend, Scarlet. Bro, wait, Scarlet, bro, please. Bro. Scarlet! Bro, the PA system isn't ready yet. The PA system isn't ready. Please. Well, that's the end of today's video. I hope you liked it. Please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. I'm sorry it's short, but like, I got things to do. And if you want these videos, sometimes they're gonna be short. Okay. But anyways, um, today's comment is: Do you like? FNAF fan games more than the original or do you like the original over like the fan games? Me That's not, that actually I don't know why I asked that question. That's kinda hard. I kinda like the original, but like the fan games give like they explore out of like the original plot of like FNAF and like you do different mechanics and like 
like see and here you can stare at the animatronics in the original FNAF you can't really stare at them be too long you gotta close a door this you don't even got no doors so now you get to hold the light on them but I mean yeah you always have to close like a freaking door or put a mask on or something so I like this I kind of like FNAF fan games a little more because they have more creativity in it but FNAF I like FNAF for the plot and the lore yes anyways that's the end thanks for watching Bam. <laughs>